Hi, Jerry Costello from foodpantrysoftware.net. And today I'd like to give you a short demonstration of using the food pantry software. Click on the start. Go to the food pantry software folder. Click on the food pantry software icon. So this would be the main page. This is the name of this food pantry. This is the name of the contact people and their phone numbers. So from this main page, you could just enter a new client from the data entry. Enter the client and any dependents. Click Save. Enter any other new clients and the dependents. Click Save. So once a client's in the system, to give the food out, just click on this button. Click on the client. Shows information about the client. If this food pantry were to weigh the food, they could enter the information in here. They can enter any memos in there. And click Save. Click Other Clients. Click Save. Now, if this food pantry had the optional software set up for workstation, which it does, this would be the screen on the optional computer where they give the food out. So from here you'll see that I'll select a client, click Save, and in the other part of your food pantry, with this terminal list, you can see Maria's name showed up here. So same thing. So I could enter the food weight in here, enter a memo in here, and once the food is given to the client, click on the close button. And this page is updated every 10 seconds. So once the food is given to the pa patron, It just goes away. So this is a really nice feature to have, especially if you have a sizable food pantry. Whereas this would be the intake, the process, and the people check in. Click Save. Pops up on this side over here where the food is given out on the other side of the food pantry. You can add the weight in here if you so choose. That's a lot of weight. Click on the close button. Give the food out to Maria. Click on the close button. And that goes away. So that would be the second computer they would be using at the point of distribution to the patrons. So I'm going to do here now, I'm going to close out on the food out transactions. I'm going to go to the reports page. So there's quite a few reports. In addition to reports, this software will generate Excel files that will save the files right to your desktop. So I'm going to select a start date for the report. I'm going to pick the month, I'm going to pick the day, click OK, click on the icon. I select the default date, just click OK. You can select preview the report or print directly. All food pantry visits, I'll click on that one. I'm going to run the report. Report comes up. I have a choice here to either print or just click on close. Select any one of these reports or Excel files and just click on the run report.
So this has been a quick demonstration of using the food pantry software. And other videos will have information about installing the software as well as using all these other features of the software. What you could do if you really wanted to, you could go to the website foodpantrysoftware.net and just download the manual that a look at all the features that are involved in the food pantry software. If you need any help with installation or moving your existing clients into this system, please let us know. foodpantrysoftware.net Thank you.